In a prior video in this series, we talked about identifying S1 and S2, but keep in mind that there are variations to each of these sounds, some of which are normal and others abnormal. The S1 heart sound is produced by the closure of the atrioventricular valves. And depending on different variables, such as the time in which they close, a person's anatomy, or different physiologic states, the sound of S1 may vary. Variations to the S1 heart sound can occur due to changes in its intensity or how loud it sounds. The sound of S1 may also vary depending on how the atrioventricular valves close in relation to one another. For example, if the tricuspid valve closes after the mitral valve, the S1 would be split into different components. These variations to the S1 heart sound can be normal, or they may be suggestive of underlying pathology. Normal variations in S1 include differences in intensity of the S1 heart sound when compared to S2 at different auscultation points. At the base of the heart, S1 is softer than S2, whereas at the apex, S1 is usually louder than S2. S1 at the base, S1 at the apex, base, apex. The other potentially normal variation of S1 is splitting of the S1 sound. It's the result of the closure of the tricuspid valve slightly after the mitral valve, and although it might be very faint, can be best heard along the left lower sternal border. Keep in mind that a split S1 can also be suggestive of an underlying pathology, such as in the case of people with right bundle branch blocks, where the delay in right ventricular conduction leads to a slight delay in the closure of the tricuspid valve in relation to the mitral valve. Other abnormal variations in S1 include an exaggerated S1, which can be heard in tachycardia and other hyperdynamic states, and also in mitral stenosis. A diminished S1 heart sound, seen in first-degree heart blocks, calcified mitral valves, heart failure, and coronary artery disease, and a dynamic S1 intensity variations seen in pathologies such as complete heart blocks and atrial fibrillation. To learn more about S1 variations, visit auscultate.medschool.com, where you can listen to and compare these variations side by side. Also, don't forget to subscribe, click on that notification bell, and head over to our channel to watch more videos and other medical educational content.